Welcome to the first day of school vlog. I'm low-key eating first because I just, I have not packed my backpack or gotten out my school clothes, but I could care less. I'm telling you, I already feel the senioritis. Like, I didn't realize school was starting. Like, it doesn't feel real. And I was just like, oh, I can pack my backpack later. Like, I got no school supplies. Like, I used to bring a notebook for each class, but now I'm just like, gee, if they say I need a notebook, then I'll get a notebook afterwards. Yeah, I have to pack that. And my sports bag. And then do my makeup and then yeah change. I'm just associating. I hate school. Ignore the shitty lighting, but I have to do my makeup. <sighs> Anyways. I'm just saying you can hate school and still get good grades, okay? Like super grateful for the stuff I'm learning in school, but I feel like I enjoyed Sorry, I'm looking at the mirror to the side because there's no mirror right here, but oh my gosh, I forgot sunscreen. Shit, this is what happens when you don't go to school for a long time. Okay, but I just feel like I liked online school better because you could just go in during office hours and ask the questions that you need to ask and then get out of there. I feel like school, I'm just sitting there for unnecessary periods of time. And it's like, they go at the same pace. So it's like, I didn't need to spend this much time on this topic, but I need it on this topic. So, and unfortunately half the time for me, it's just sitting there in class. And I feel like my time could just be used better. That's why I like online school. Like, yes, there needs to be some tweaks in online school. Cause like it wasn't as effective. But the structure of online school for me had potential. Anyways, just cover up everything. Anyways, also probably need to get new like foundation because I just realized I'm gonna get like ten shades darker during season. But if you like school, I love that for you. But I stayed up till two a.m. watching PLL, so <laughs> and it's seven right now. And I'm technically already running late. I was like, I can't fall asleep. So just gonna watch Pretty Little Liars. Concealer, can't open it. I know I'm using this wall and I could care less. Just whatever. And then atrocious brush. Oh, don't look at that. But anyways, like, if you need to romanticize school, romanticize school. Do what you need to do to get those grades. Or to try your best, you know what I mean? And like, for academics, honestly, I feel like as long as you try your best, there's really nothing you could have done more. You know, some people study really hard and still don't get an A because unfortunately they're just, like, maybe they're not good test takers or something. But the school system is flawed, but it is what it is, unfortunately. And I know some kids who never have to spend time studying and they still get A's and they're in like really hard classes, like all APs. So I'm just saying like, it's okay. Like it is, it is good to try. Yes, try your best, but don't like be too harsh on yourself. Like last year I was depressed cause I was trying so hard for that fucking A and in calculus but that was low-key my redemption because i failed i like didn't get an a in honors chemistry and i had an a9 i was like okay redemption round but low-key was depressed <laughs> don't know if it was worth it i did not post my schedule i know everyone's like hey classes but i'm just like i don't give a fuck like the classes aren't gonna change, so I'm just like, okay, it's just gonna be a surprise. Like, I know maybe I'll probably regret that later and go like, I have no friends, but you know what? Like, that's that's just reality. Like, cause the counselor won't change it just cause a friend requests, you know what I mean? I need to hurry, I'm gonna be late and I still have to pack my shit, shit. Regretting not being prepared. 
Okay, you know what? I, I, this is good enough. Okay, I'm gonna pack my bag after this. Whatever, whatever. Whatever. I would get a nicer backpack. Camel's not even my thing, but it's literally like, it's gonna be trashed at school anyway. And I got it for free, so. iPad, a must. Not sure if this is in frame, but pencil case. This usually has my ID wallet and AirPods. AirPods. Laptop. I lost my other case, so I'll just use this one. Which electronics to school. <laughs> okay, next, I pack my sports bag. The bad thing about starting with sports is it's hot as shit. And then you're gonna be sweaty. I gotta change out of all this, but shoes. And hat. I use the Hawaiian Tropic one because it's glittery. <laughs> Random like ugly t-shirt. Nike shorts. Time to stuff it in. Ooh, breath mint. Love Altoids. Great. Mm. Should I bring a book? Whatever. Oh my gosh, and I forgot the product give me a second like what if i showed up to school like a ghost because i always leave fucking foundation on like my upper lip i use the dior lip stain but low-key it, it said there's chemicals in here that can cause cancer but you know what i already bought it so also because i have time right now because my friend is in here i'm gonna do my glossier perfume the lighting, sorry, is always shitty in my room because I only have one window right here. So light comes this way. So essentially you want to stand facing the sunlight. But I have a TV over there. So there's like a whole ass reflection. Anyways. But I watched Gran Turismo the other day. It's pretty good. But I heard, you know, it depends on the racing community or whatever. Because they were like, oh, it's accurate representation of know how dangerous motorsport is but then someone was saying how ford versus ferrari does a better job i haven't watched that but i liked it like sometimes you just want a classic pepperoni pizza and it delivered the underdog story in my opinion and the ending credits were low-key kind of cool because it's based on a true story last day last, last day, day of first day last first day of school you know man how yeah last what's your thoughts we've been here since kinder Bro, I just want to get this here over Okay, with. let's go. Oh Ali's here. Ali, don't move too much so that I don't have to move the blur. So first, last first day, what do you um, think? I'm tired. I've been here since 8. I want to leave. Last first day. In my bright so yellow. I'm waiting for class to start. But it's zero period right now, so I came early. I'm waiting for class to start. I'm business. Okay, guys, Lucas is here. I want to go, go visit you at your job. Better. Okay, I will. I will. Okay, last first day. Thoughts? You've been here since kindergarten, too, you know? I have. I was talking to Nicole about it. Have you been here since here, kindergarten? Yeah, we've been. Were you in Campbell's? No, you look like a Johnson kid. I was a Johnson Yeah, you were a Johnson <laughs> Okay, thoughts? Thoughts? Um, I'm hot. I'm sweaty. Can you believe it? We're like. No, stop. Stop, stop. <laughs> Stop triggering me. I'm gonna get depression. I influenced Lucas to get an Check iPad. Out. Check this out. That's I know. crazy. I know. Okay. And you got the pen too. To Buy everything refurbished because you get like oh, really? a few hundred dollars off. Shit, yeah. okay. We're in business. I'm gonna be in the vlog, Gabby. Hello. How's your day? It's okay. This is our only class together. And they were in it. <laughs> I had a great summer, and now we're back in calculus. Excuse my bangs, but they have to dry this way. Anyways, it's like 4.30, and I almost fell asleep in econ class, so I'm just going to take a nap now.
but low key like I was robbed. I was like robbed. Like my friends. Okay, so for our gov and econ at our school, they switch every other day. So Monday you're doing gov, Tuesday you're doing econ, and so on. And apparently, at first the teacher was like, "Oh, if my name's." like first on your schedule then you're supposed to be in this class well her name was first but then they weren't going by that they were going by like stars and stripes so essentially when i'm in gov my friends are in econ and then when we switch when i'm in econ they're in gov because apparently they were stars and i was striped i was so misled i was like girl why low-key and then i had i had practice afterwards and i was roasting like a fucking apollo local chicken like it was hot it was like 90 something and we're playing like challenge matches but it suck ass anyways anyways i'm gonna take a nap <laughs> I'm back here with my Yifong, hoping it'll focus. But anyways. I'm telling you, you don't need to buy all these things. It's okay to look like a hopeful at school. Like, who am I attracting at school? There's no one good looking at school. Anyways, and then I had a green folder last year, couldn't find it, so I guess I'm using this ratty ass thing that says, I've totally got this. But today we just had a bunch of syllabuses to sign, and of course I stocked up on paper, because Timu Hall. And I've just been watching PLL for like the past two hours since dinner because practice was asked well found a folder didn't find the one i was looking for like did i just throw away the folder along with my motivation to work but yeah like i don't know what's going on with my senior year senioritis like my lunch group is still sitting on the floor eating lunch we've been like that since sophomore year you'd think we get a table but we just i think we just stopped giving fucks <laughs> I had to get three sheets of paper from Lucas this morning because I was like, oh yeah. And I also realized this is going to be the most relaxing day of my school year because it's the first day where they don't assign anything technically. But yeah, I'm going to go to bed now. Thanks for watching my first day of school vlog, I guess. I'll keep you updated on how much of a hellhole this turns out to be because this is just the first day. Bye.